right, so here we have a WordPress version uh, 5.2.1, which is uh, the latest version of WordPress. I'm just going to show you how you can convert your website into Classic Press. So when you go to the Classic Press website and you go to the download section of it, you'll find a couple of links right here, and you can download Classic Press itself, the core files, or you can go for the migration uh, plugin. So when you, it takes you to the GitHub repository of Classic Press, and I'm just going to go for the switch to Classic Press um, release. So when you download this and save it, and just go back into your administration area, all you need to do is add this as a plugin. So you just browse uh, into your, your WordPress, and then you upload this plugin that's going to help us switch to Classic Press. So the next thing you do is uh, find the location of that file, which is this, upload it and install plugin. So once the plugin is done installing, all you need to do is activate it. And once the activation is done, once the activation is done, you're presented with an option to switch. And you can also find this in your tool section of switching to Classic Press. So once you click that, then uh, the other options for, for switching to Classic Press will come. So Classic, the migration tool will uh, get the minimum version of uh, your server and check whether it's 5.6, because with Classic Press you need something that's 5.6 or newer, mine is 7.21, so we are good to go. It will check whether they are, the, all the necessary things that are needed are there. And it looks like we're ready to go, so just hit the button to switch to Classic Press. Well, depending on your link, uh, we'll see that now everything is ready. Our database is updating and upgrading. Uh, and we are welcomed to our Classic Press website. Everything is uh, as it should be if we go in the plugin section. Uh, we'll find that we still have these uh, plugins coming in from uh, WordPress, but uh, we don't need to use these anymore. Uh, so you can have those deleted, you can deactivate this particular plugin, and also delete it because you already have the classic press that you're looking for. So yeah, you're ready to go, and you're ready to use. So welcome to classic press. Uh, you'll see, of course, uh, the Classic Press petitions coming in from the website of Classic Press, and you're able to join in with the voting and also giving comments by just clicking on one uh, particular item that you're interested in. You can head over to the site, uh, sign in, and then you can add a comment or add your thoughts, or even open up a new uh, petition for yourself to, to see where you want Classic Press to be. Classic Press has vowed to be more democratic than WordPress is, so the developers get to decide uh, more clearly what goes into core, uh, working with uh, the lead developers at Classic Press. So you can see what's happening in with the petitions, and you can also get the information coming in from uh, uh, Classic Press. So we're ready to work with, uh, with our new website, and uh, enjoy Classic Press.